What's up guys, Bo3681 back here with another video, and I may look different, I know I am lacking some of my hair, but I cut my own hair, and that part did not miss, that is actually intentional how that is, but yeah, I, I end up missing a spot. But, I did that to cover that up, but I'm going to fix it soon. But, in today's video will be a story time. Not just a story time, but I might add a game, I'm still thinking about it. But, before we get started with this video, if you are new, hit the subscribe button. If you are old, you know what to do. And I know I've been lacking videos but since we probably won't go back to school May 15th at least for me anyhow they said either May 15th or next year August it's still kind of thinking about it because of this coronavirus that's going around but I hope everybody stays safe and I hope everybody stays healthy and I know some people could care less. Which, if you care less about staying clean, you are a filthy individual. You, you are just disgusting. If you don't wash your fucking self or sanitize your damn hands at least once a day. But, let's get on with it. And Oh yeah, I don't know if y'all saw my Snapchat. I had sliced my middle finger open it's closed and healing now but i have no feeling in my middle finger at all i think i cut a nerve but let's get on with the story so today's story time well i've been thinking about this story for a long time and i, I think it deserves to be Probably a story time y'all might want to hear because some of y'all who watch this, at least 1% of y'all who watch my videos, I talk to personally. And some of y'all don't even know me besides the stupid videos I make on this damn channel. Or barely make on this channel. But, I think... I think this tops them all. So, so, is, I just hate when this thing don't focus at all. I'll be right back. Oh, no. There it goes. But, Let's just get started with this story. So, some of y'all might know about the girlfriend I have now. She, she's from Philadelphia, and I know what some of y'all yee-yee boys are going to say. Man, why are you dating a Yankee? Because uh, there's, there's really no point of judging who people are. I mean, even though I'm Southern, and my mom's from from the North. She's from Pennsylvania. And, I mean, honestly, what's wrong with dating someone who came from the North? I mean, I know some of them that moved down here are kind of cocky. But, she's a nice girl. She treats me right. And actually makes me fucking happy and not pissed off all the time. But I think I think this story about my last relationship would really kick this off. Because I some stories I don't even talk about my last relationships, but I think this one. This one this one y'all might feel bad about me and also be glad. I'm 
gone with her because this to be honest if I stay with her any longer I, I probably would not most likely would have hit myself in the head with a pipe. but instead of rambling let's get on with it so my my last ex I ain't going to explain his name because of private series and some of y'all may know who it is and I, I can understand if y'all want to beat her fucking ass so she I got with her before school started of this year and we lasted till December and for some reason she would call me constantly every day like me I got stuff to do throughout the day I mean I don't have time to call people i mean some some days i'm busy some days i'm not and i just text people but when i was hunting when i was fishing she would call me like i would go out in the blind to go deer hunt like 5 30 a.m and by the time i start like getting set up and i start like hearing the deer walk my phone literally be buzzing and buzzing. I'm like, oh dear God. So I'd answer him, tell her that I'm hunting, hang up. And then by the time I do that, deer or squirrel would run off. And that really made me mad because I have a, I had spotted a big 14 point buck behind my house and I was trying to get him. And every time I would go hunting, ring, 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 ring. It, it made me want to just blow my phone up with my fucking shotgun. And I know some of y'all would have asked me why didn't I tell you sooner. Well, oh well, I mean, I have a tendency to do that. I won't tell, like, the private stuff until, like, after I left her. But, and then... She had lied to my best friend multiple times. She made me mad to the point where I was literally busting stuff with my fist. Literally, I had two mirrors and I broke them both with my fist. And she would always make me worry and stressed out. And it was kind of like messing me up a little bit, but not at the time. And then... You won't believe how badly she pissed me off. So, she usually waked up about 6.20. So, I wake up about 6.19. And it was it was 6.19, so I, so I call her. And some reason we would stay on video chat for all night and that kind of made me mad because I didn't like my phone always almost exploded and I woke up at 620 and she got up and started getting cocky with me and no boy you don't get cocky with me you don't be no fucking dick to me when I'm trying to wake you up at the time you told me to wake you up. So we start arguing back and forth. So I just said, you know what? I got really pissed off. I said, you know what? Whatever. Bye. I hung up and went to school. And I was pissed all day. And this is before I started dating a girl. Now we're friends. Yeah. Um, I was about to make a joke and say friends, but we were just friends. And surprisingly, we actually liked each other while I was with this girl. I know... Some of y'all might think that's wrong, but honestly, my ex was literally stressing the fuck out of me and just always, just always wanting something. If I ain't going to say what it is. Some of y'all might know by this. I, I can call it story time, I guess. But... I had smack. I, I was. I actually was pissed, and I started just smacking the fuck out of the wall. And she was telling me stop and calm down, and 
And she rubbed my shoulders and I was just calming down. So we break up around New Year's and I was I was just really messed up. So and all reality she was just crazy and straight out just rude because she everybody that trusted her and really looked up to her she had deceived and betrayed and and all the people who was affected by her I, I know how it is I mean I'm over it now it's just really it's just really just bad because some people some people in this world are just, are just like controlling or, I have trouble saying this, I'm sorry I have dyslexia, but, molliptative or something like that, I'm sorry, but some people just, just pretends to bring trust into people and turns around and deceives them and it really hurts a lot of people and some people and things that happen some people have to go to therapy for that and that's not and i feel bad for the people who has to go through that hurt and all that because those those people want to deceive people and if it looks like i've been crying no i'm just tired as hell i've been up all night <laughs> But, really, really, as I, as I said, any juicy information won't be disclaimed in this video because I don't think it's really friendly enough because it's really none in anybody's business. I mean, the people who know, and if anybody comments on here, Asking me why didn't I add the juicy details because it's really none of, none of your fucking business. I'm sorry, but it, it's really it's really my private situation. So because I know how people are on YouTube, I know how some fans get. If people don't like to say nothing, fans would get mad for not adding juicy and details. Honestly, I could care less in my life my channel my videos i'll add in whatever i want and for some of y'all who might not like my hair well just to tell you you're, you're dead particles on your head i mean it grows back <laughs> but this is today's video if y'all want to see more story times probably coming up soon fishing videos vlogs any of that just hit the subscribe button and hit that notification bell to be notified every time I make a new video. And I'm the reason I haven't said, I haven't done any Red Dead Redemption 2 videos because my Xbox is busted. So and some of your PS4 players might be like, "Well, Xbox sucks." No, it's just one little thing wrong with that. I have to get it fixed. It ain't that. It ain't that expensive. And I... I don't know, but... I'll see y'all guys later. Bubba3681 out. And keep it freaking redneck.